Hey everybody, how you guys doing today? Today we are going to be looking at a new feature of, um, you know, Fortnite settings called, where is it here? Dynamic 3D resolution. And we're going to see, does it actually impact performance? That's, that's really what we got to see here. But essentially what dynamic 3D resolution is, it says dynamic 3D resolution occasionally increases the resolution that objects are rendered in game when your GPU is underused. Okay, so what does that mean? That what, what like what does that mean for people who don't know? Like you're reading that. So let's say your GPU is only being used at like 50 or 60 percent. What it's going to do is it's going to see that your GPU is not being used, and it's going to render objects in higher resolution okay so it's that, that's essentially what it's going to do but there's a little you know caveat here and i'm going to kind of go over that with you and as always guys shameless plug here but definitely you know hit up that subscribe and don't forget you can use aaron fhd as a creator code so go ahead and support that'd be really appreciated and we're going to actually go to the documents of Unreal Engine here where it says dynamic resolution. So I don't know if this is the same thing. I think it is. But essentially what dynamic resolution does in the Unreal Engine says dynamic resolution adjusts the primary screen perception according to the previous GPU workload. The resolution adjusts as needed based on uh, heuristic for example, when there are too many objects on the screen and it's too expensive, effect suddenly enters a frame, the GP render time will increase and the resolution of the screen will be lowered to maintain the targeted frame rate. So I don't know if this is the same thing, and I think it is because just me looking at, for example, where it says dynamic resolution here and things like that, I'm, I'm pretty sure this is the exact same thing. Um, because that's kind of what I'm looking at and how you can tell here, here's, there's, there, there's these commands here. That's like, for example, dynamic resolution and, and stuff like that and how to, uh, enable it, things like that. And this is in the unreal engine, which is what Fortnite uses. So I think that's pretty much what it's doing here. And it's, it's kind of showing here the GPU frame here and stuff and, and saying, Hey, your GPU is being under you. So let's use more of it. Oh no, your GPU is hitting a bottleneck. Let's use less of it. And pretty much it's scaling dynamically the frame if it needs to, right? So if you have that on, um, from my understanding, this 3d resolution is going to go up and down based on your GPU usage. That's kind of what I'm getting here by the dynamic 3D resolution. It's saying, you know, the resolution of objects are rendered in game when your GPU is... I, I think it's talking about this 3D resolution and it's adjusting this based off of performance. So if you have this on, it's going to, you know, move up and down in game as you're playing. So obviously we want to maximize your graphics, maximize your frame rate. So let's go ahead and look at some of my stats here, see what's going on. So I am running OBS, which is taking a little bit, um, and it's it's using OBS is using a lot of my GPU. Like right now, as you can see, it's using 40% of my GPU. And if you actually look at, you know, my sensors, video load engine is at like 16%. So I'm using NV at ENC, which is um, the recording codec for um, NVIDIA graphics and you can see just like my GPU load is at 96% so what I'm going to try and do is see if I I mean like it's really tough to actually get a full kind of diagnostics of this because OBS is using so much of my GPU and that's probably why my frame rate is taking such a big hit but you're looking at between look right now one four one like one between 100 and 140. My CPU load is really good, um, so I'm not it, really. This is not my CPU that's having the issue. Um, it's really my GPU. So if I go back here, let's go to settings. 
And you know what? We're just going to turn everything on epic right now and hit apply. And we're really going to... So the crazy thing is me having everything on epic puts me at like six, it like caps me at 60, which is pretty good. It's trying, like the dynamic resolution is trying to keep me at, um, the dynamic resolution is trying to keep me at 160, but it can't. So let me just take this and see if I can, I really want to like, See if I can really try and hurt the FPS here. My lows are going into the top of the 30 frames. Okay, that's cool. There's some motorcycles in here. That's really... The motorcycles are really going to actually see. Here we go. Got a motorcycle here. Perfect. Let me see my frame rate. I'm really doing a lot right now. actually not doing like too too bad but once again though like i've got everything on max so let's really uh da, 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 da. we'll turn the shadows off because shadows just kill the game i want to try and reach my 160 so the global illumination is obviously too hitting hard Let's turn global illumination off as well. Da, 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 da. Where is it? Global illumination. Let's just turn that off. See how that's doing now. And now I'm getting a higher. Yeah, I'm getting. I'm getting now close to the 160. So really, really, the test for me is it when I have OBS off. That's really, really going to be the test. So I'm going to go ahead and turn OBS off, guys, and then report back to you in a second. So, everybody, yeah. So essentially, um, me using OBS Studio is literally just... It, like it's it's hurting my it's hurting my GPU essentially because OBS uses GPU as well, and that I guess is why a lot of people use dual streaming PCs. <laughs> so you know, like I'm losing any I, I'm losing up to 40 frames just because of OBS. So that's really really hurting me. Um, but dynamic resolution, I've been I was trying it without OBS. And it is definitely helping my frames. It's trying to keep me at 60 frames. So definitely check it out. Uh, I mean, tell me what you guys think. And guys, thanks. And make sure you hit up that subscribe. Thanks very much. Bye.